presidential scholarship. This is a full tuition scholarship. Eligible candidates must apply. Hello, guys. Welcome to another day. Welcome to other opportunities around the U.S. universities. So today's video, we are going to look at multiple universities with different scholarships. Um, just before we get started, I just want to remind you that um, the spring semester, the priority deadline for most of the universities will be November 1, and you should have that in mind. So if you are preparing for spring semester, be sure to apply before November 1. So you will be on the priority list to get funding opportunities, okay? So let's start with, um, this is George Marston University, credit assistantship, lectureship, and other on-campus employment can provide you with experience in your field of study through teaching, research, and professional training. Now, if you are new to this channel, what I've decided to do now, instead of looking at programs and all of that, Look, I just look at universities and see the scholarship, the offers, whether it's graduate assistantship or merit-based scholarship. And this is both for graduate and undergraduate. Okay. So let's just have that. So you can see here, this the programs are designed to help students complete their degree requirements. The degree division oversees graduate student hiring policies as well as Associated appointment document, assistantship and lectureship opportunities are posted in mass in job handshake or on academic department page. Students can also contact their program directors or advisors for assistantship information and opportunities. For this one, I think if you have been with me, I have said it a thousand times already. Okay, like for Graduate students, just go to the university. And once you get the university, reach out to graduate coordinator before even you put application. So you see, these are the assistantship positions, the graduate research, which means you are going to work with a professor in a certain um, area uh, for a research. And this is teaching. You have to do some jobs as well, like you teach certain courses. And for some teaching assistantship, you actually don't teach what you do you prepare a max scheme, okay? Um, I have worked with teaching assistants, um, uh, um, students, so I know what I'm saying. So this is graduate professional assistance, which means, again, you have to work, but this is not purely academics. This might be other uh, managerial positions, like um, you work in a photocopy shop, a student participating in non-teaching or non-research position performing work in which they gain experience related to the academic programs, and that is significantly connected to their field of study and career preparation. Okay. And this is graduate lectureship. I think this is now where you have to lecture. Okay. So check this university on campus, employment as well. So check this university, George Mason University. I'm not going to look at the programs they offer. I think that's something most of you should be able to do now. If you are new to the channel, but you've not done that, all you have to do, always go to academics section, okay, or programs and see some of the programs. So that's it for this first university. And this is another university. Okay, so this is another university. This is Ganon University. And if you come down, Ganon Scholarship and Awards, Ghana University offers a variety of scholarship grants and awards, recognition of students, um, recognition of students' academic and athletic accomplishment, demonstrated need, and outstanding talent. These grants and scholarships are renewable each year based on criteria defined in annual importance information regarding financial aid. Uh, so if you come down, it says presidential scholarship. This is a full tuition scholarship. Eligible candidates must apply and be accepted to the university by this is December 15. That's the deadline for spring. The top 10% of the accepted um, students by this date will be invited to compete in the scholarship contents with the ability to earn a full tuition scholarship up to eight, uh, up to top eight participants in the scholarship contents will receive full tuition scholarship. This is another one, founder scholarship up to 24,000 per year. Academic Excellence Award, 22,000 to 23,000. Academic Year, 
Night Achievement Awards, 20,000, 21,000. Okay, Maroon or Gold Award, 18,000. Uh, Dioscan Related Awards, Roman Catholic. Uh, this is another one. Academic Competition, and this is just for specific programs, biology, business, from 500 to 3,000, chemistry, education, engineering, health professional, social sciences, additional scholarship, diversity, up to 2,000. And all of these scholarship counts a lot. Okay, it will help you a lot, some varies. Okay, so that's it for Ga um, Ganon University. Yes, this is in Pennsylvania. And this is another university. This is Franklin Marshall. So they have, yes, scholarship opportunities, make scholarship. All applicants are considered for make scholarship. No additional applications is required. Scholarship are awarded at the time of admission and are enabled up to eight semesters. Okay, this is from the graduates. Provide, uh, provided students remain in good standing. For applicants entering the fall of 2025, make scholarship will be offered to 35,000 per year. So you have up to 70,000. This is diplomatic leadership, scholarship up to 15,000. You have athletic scholarship, tuition exchange scholarship. So this is Franklin Marshall College. And there should be um, scholarship as well for graduates. So which one again, which one like university? This is again, okay, the same Franklin University. They have need-based need -based aid. And if you know what need-based is, so if the university cost of ascendance um, is, so how do you calculate need-based is that the total cost of attendance minus what the family can provide equals to need-based. So the university will provide 100% need-based. So if the family can provide based on the university, we will say the family should provide a minimum of this, or the family will provide a minimum of, let's say, $10,000 or $5,000. The remaining part of the tuition or total cost will be covered by the university. And these are merit scholarship. Talked about this one already. Okay, yes, we talked about this. So this is Franklin Marshall College. Then let's look at another university. This is Emory University, um, type, types of financial aid. Let's see, explore eight programs, start your application. Let's see, let's just come down, okay. I just want to take it direct to the page. Let me see. I think I must have open type of financial aid, grants and scholarship, grants and scholarship. You have need-based programs as well. You have merits based scholarship, tuition benefits programs. So, scholarship you bring. Um, let me see if I can go to the specifics. Mm, scholarship are based on federal scholarship undergraduate student institutional grant. And so, as I said, even if it's undergraduate, so you must realize that there should be graduate scholarship as well. This is need-based grant, which of course you don't have to pay the Emory grants. Uh, the Emory University grants is offered to students with the demonstrated financial need. Okay, financial aid package that include Emory University grants are made to full-time students only. However, uh, final year seniors who are permitted to underload are eligible to receive rated grant available to all undergraduate students. Different different scholarships. Okay. Um, let's see. So that's for need base. You have this merit based scholarship as well. Um, and the CSS provide for international students or incoming students. I need to make a video on that tuition benefits programs by department. Now, let me see. This is the same Emory. Yes, university, and this is for graduate and professional um, students. 
these are the different school of business. So when you click on each of these, you know, you will get information regarding scholarship opportunities, school of law. Okay, this is nursing, this is medicine, this is public health, and this is theology. If you click on each of these, you get information regarding scholarship and about financial aid. So if you click credit financial aid, this is um, operating principles for student loan provided. Okay, not that one. That's basic academic progress. We don't need this one type of plan about your school's financial aid programs. So just like I told you, check each of, depending on the program you are applying to, you just click on that and you should be able to find information regarding scholarship opportunities. Okay? So for me, I have to do it for almost all of you because uh, I need to try my best to satisfy you guys. Like, try to look at different. So if you are just from one area, financial aid by schools, see? As I told you, by schools. So just check each of these, basically. Okay? And that's key. Um, this is graduate health professionals. You click on this, you should be able to get scholarship information. You click on School of Nursing, you should be able to get additional scholarships. So let's look at another university. Uh, I don't, okay, yes. This is um, the Paul. So when you come to this scholarship for international students, scholarship for US citizens and residents, if you click on this, they will tell you scholarship amounts very based in part or your academic profile. This is a one-time scholarship that spans the first three quarters and enrollment cannot be used in conjunction with other default scholarship waivers or awards. Students are automatically screened for these scholarships. So you don't even have to do separate application. Um, so if you look at this, the Health Start Dean Scholarship is for new students who are not US citizens or permanent. Scholarship amounts very based impact on your academic profile. Um, this is one time, to more like the same as that. Okay. So if you look, if you look at this one, graduate admission, just click on this and you'll be able to get information regarding scholarship as well. This is Cobley College. So this is another one. This is Cobley. Call by call by college, okay. So no fees, no loan, no barriers, no fees, no loan. This 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 university, I think there's a commitment that they meet need base. That's it. Okay, we pledge to meet one hundred percent of your demonstrated financial need without loans. If your family has a total income of seventy five thousand dollars or less, okay with assets typically of this income range, we, will, we have ensured they will have a parent or guardian contribution of zero dollars. With families total income, this to 100 and typically assets, typical assets and your parent or guardian contribution will be no more than 10,000. So no more than 10,000, okay? So if you provide less than, okay, not more than that or around 10,000, and the rest will be covered by the university. Basically, no student loans. So they ensure that your family what, and there is no fee to apply to this university. Okay, test scores are optional. Do not require any additional writing samples. You will just imagine how easy it is. Okay, 95% of families with an income $200 or less qualify for financial aid. The IWI financial aid offer for incoming students is nearly $67,000. Okay. And these are some, I think, uh, what is this? A partnership. Okay. So that's it for call B. They meet 100%. This is another university. This is Pontla. Let me see. Okay. Booknail in Booknell University scholarship programs, as you can see. So I just click on an early decision, November 15. So we have at Merit Scholarship. This is by up to $20,000 annually. And this is community college scholarship programs, engagement, presidential fellowship, 30,000. 
dollars annually. So the scholarships are there. So, but these ones you apply for them is that scholarship application required. And this other one, no scholarship application required. They're like the Dean Fellowship, which is around 15,000 annually, the Bois Scholarship Program, Scholars Program. Again, this is a need based scholarship for highly qualified students. Um, this is partner scholarship programs, okay. So, seeing the same university is for graduate students now, academic requirement admission, and these are just some of the programs they offer, civil engineering, chemical, English, mechanical engineering, okay, biology, chemistry, electrical, psychology, environmental engineering, application deadline, this is for fall semester, but we are not talking of for we are talking of now for the next year. Okay, credit assistantship positions are there, as you can see. So this is for Buknell University. Okay. Let's look at another university. Uh, we are here to ensure that nothing stands between your way and your success as a student. Uh, this is bow drawing. I don't know if I'm pronouncing these names fine. This is Baldwin. It's one, it's one of only eight colleges and universities that is a need blind. The ability to pay is never a factor or barrier for admission and meet the full calculated need of every student we admit. Whether you are an international student or domestic, our financial aid support does not does not uh, financial support does not start and end with the tuition bills for many students. It starts with an application fee waiver, so you don't even have to pay any application and ends with scholarship to graduate students with lots more during your time at bound doing. So let's just finish with this university. I guess this video is getting too long. Um, the average financial aid package for students in the most recent entering class is $69,000 with need-based bound scholarship ranging from 8,950 to 82,000. <laughs> bound is a need blind for all applicants, which means that your ability to pay is never a factor or barrier to admission. Okay, so all you have to do is just check the programs if your program um, falls within this university. I think it's just the same thing I'm saying here. I'm applying as an international student, as an international student is anyone who, who will require a student visa beginning in July 2020, Bowen College is a need blind for international students. Okay. Anyways, I think we should just stop here. Uh, I think I have another one, two universities. This is Buela and this is another university, Bansley. Well, we have these ones. This video is getting too long. Okay, guys, so just, just check this university. So I'm going to leave the link. Check the university, go straight to your program. If you are a graduate student, reach out to graduate um, coordinators, express your interest by email with your transcript, okay, and your CV that you are interested in their program based on the program you've looked at, okay? And you want to ask for um, scholarship opportunities and put in application. That's, that's just the way we do it, okay? So if you enjoyed this video or you find this video useful, please consider giving it a like, share. And if you've not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Let's build this community together. Thank you for being with me. See you again in my next video.